Nelson uh, holds a uh, NABF 154-pound uh, championship title, uh, which he defeated John Jackson, who's fighting on the uh, main card a little bit later on. The southpaw, Daryl Cunningham in the green trunks, 29 and 8. Hails from Detroit, Michigan. He turned pro in August of 03 with a win in Detroit. Then he won that canvas, uh, actually won 18 of his first 20 fights, if you look at the, all 20 of them. And his last nine fights, uh, going back to December 2011, he's 5 and 4. Doesn't have a lot of power right now. And part of the reason for that is the way he throws his power hand, his left hand, he kind of has it turned over. And when he throws it, there can't be a lot of power. Watch for that. Watch what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the guy in the green trunks right now. Willie Nelson. You think Willie Nelson's a strange name for a fighter? Well, how about this? Boxrec lists 14 fighters named Willie Nelson over the years. This kid has an extensive amateur background, over 250 bouts, a couple of police athletic league championships along the way. He's known to use his height and reach, and he has an extensive reach over Cunningham here. Cunningham looks like to be a long, gangly guy, but get this, Nelson has a 13-inch reach advantage, and he's four inches taller, and he'll use that. He knows how to use it against the southpaw. Comes with that uppercut on the inside and rocks Cunningham right away. Really going here. And he drops it with a kind of a left hand and a right hand. And uh, it didn't look like a pop of shot. It almost looked like a push, but the count is up to six and seven. And he finally gets up to eight as uh, Eddie Claudio goes ahead and uh, counts up to eight. And his Nelson skipping in here in the first round. And Cunningham, it's very dangerous for him because when he comes in and wheels to the body, he's totally exposed upstairs. And that's what happened. Willie Nelson nailed him with the right hand and the left hand. And it looked like the right hand, he kind of pushed him down, but he had already done the damage. The right there, more damage was done as he whipped the uh, 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 hard, hard, uh, ripped the left hand of the body just below the rib cage in the area of the liver. Here's a big uppercut on the inside. Cunningham taking some serious punishment here now. He drops him again for the second time. It's up to three and four. He should be able to get up. His eyes look clear. It's seven, eight, and he does uh, make it up. He looks like he's okay. Eddie Claudio says, walk towards me. His eyes are clear. His legs appear to be okay. And... The ref sees him stumble forward and stops the fight. This will be a first-round technical knockout. He saw him. Oh, wait a minute. Did he stop the fight at night? I guess he did. Yeah, it is over. Yeah, he did stop the fight. He says it's all over. He signaled that it's all over. So it'll be scored as a first-round technical knockout victory for Willie Nelson. How about that? Came at 2.43 of the very first round. Look at this. Really pummeling him, and finally he goes down. Cutting him down a couple of times in the round. That, that uppercut, I'll tell you, Eddie Claudio was getting ready to stop the fight anyhow. He saw one more clean blow, but he gives him this uh, eight count anyhow. These solid shots, the left hook, the right hand in there. These aren't really connecting heavily, but he had done the damage already earlier and just kept the pressure on him. So Willie Nelson uh, does a nice job in winning his 22nd professional fight. I think you're going to hear more of him. All right, here's Lupe Contreras. Let's get this one uh, official. Ladies and gentlemen, after consulting with the ringside physician, referee Eddie Claudio calls a halt to this contest with an official time of 2 minutes 43 seconds of the opening stanza. Your winner, by way of technical knockout, Willie the Great Nelson. So this uh, Lou DeBella fighter, Lou will uh, be presenting him more. Willie Nelson does the job tonight against Daryl Cunningham as we're streaming to you live from Madison Square Garden in New York City on TopRank.com.